have a dream That's all I need I'll make it happen with some work and belief Yeah Okay Here they are saying If I understand it correctly If you are a uh, business corporation And you want to participate Your revenue needs to be 150k Above But they will look at the past 3 years or five years yeah and your primary purpose of creating a published core content so technically this these are sub requirements yeah when you meet these requirements then your Australian new business Australian news uh, business when you meet this requirement and you register then you are what? But the question is, what about inv individuals? Because I think if you look at this rule, it's only focused on big companies and it doesn't focus on small companies. Yeah. I think the most big companies, they lobby it uh, when creating those rules in order to get what they want. But... Um, the thing is, how long can they keep this going? Because news business, I think it's uh, in a couple of years, they will be out of business. Because um, news, everybody can make news. Everybody can go online. Everybody can um, show you what's happening. You have live stream. You have a lot of things that you can do. And news business, like um, some news always come afterwards. So let's say someone sees something happen, they post on social media, they show it. But on news, most time you see those news, those things are outdated. And you see a lot of people blogging or talk about things. So your news source come from everywhere. And the thing is, how long will news last? So we will see. But another thing that they, what they need to think about is the business model. Because now they don't have a clear business model where they get money for reporting the news. Because it's an old business model. They, not, they don't have a business model for that. Those big company. And now they are trying to look way to um, get money from other technologies company. So they can survive. Let me give you an example. If you work in a company. Let's say if you work in a company. And you report the news. Why? should you work for the company just to report the news under their name you can still create your own um company small company and start reporting the news and you can vlog everything about that all those things that you create you can generate income from it those big companies they have a lot of people they have a lot of equipment someone needs to pay for that and their business model is not like in the past people pay and buy the newspaper or other stuff isn't there anymore so where do they get the money from to pay for all these costs and if people leave that company they have some experience they can create their own company for themselves like a journalist they go to a country report some things about that country and try to create their own blog and some people are interested they can create their own followers why do you need to work for a big company yes it's trustworthy because they exist for a long time when you look at the the, the company they work for a long time they create a brand and you can trust that source of news i can understand that but on the long run if you don't change your business model it's not going to help you and just trying to get money from some technology it doesn't work always and if you're in another country and you are seeing news business if you're in a news business try to create your own um, business model and business model that lasts do not try to get money from other company just because you're using their platform to promote some things that's weird it seems like you cannot even think of your own business model if I look at this uh, this law I'll be like okay why would you do that I, I can't understand why you do that but on the long run the Australian news business they really need to find something for the business model it's like you're postponing the problem for in the future for other people that's going to work at the company but it's not going to last 
trust me, new business is not going to last unless they come with a new business model. So that's my opinion on this part. So let me drink some water, then we will continue. Okay, so we understand this. You need to make this much money in order to come here. This technically made only for big news big company, but it doesn't matter. Let's see. Once the news business company is ready to each responsible. Yeah, so one is if if the company is registered, the digital platform needs to follow the rules. That's what they're saying here. I understand that. okay so you cannot bargain if you're not registered that's the important part here we see here when you register you give the acml the notice that your intention is to bargain that's what they're saying here so that's where they start this is the first part one or more is yeah okay this is how many people not that interesting. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So what they're saying is <laughs> this is a stupid rule. <laughs> yeah but i can also understand why they are saying it because even if you have the rule it doesn't mean the bargaining power is balanced what they're saying here is if you have an australia news business if you have a lot of them they can discuss things together what they're saying they can work together so they can work together to talk with the digital platform because they think oh the digital platform has a lot of power so let those small people work together and attack the digital platform question you need to ask yourself is that wise think about it let's say you have a big person and you're saying hey you three people you three people are allowed to work together and take on the big person is that smart because if the big person isn't here anymore, so if the digital platform isn't here anymore, what are you going to do? So, yeah. But on the other side, if you look at the other side, you cannot prevent them from not talking with each other. They will do that. Yeah. Weird things, huh? I wouldn't say I wouldn't do this in here, but uh, I understand why they are saying it. Yeah, why I wouldn't do it is because um, it seems like you're giving the small people a lot of power. Well, in the long run, if the let's say if Facebook disappears, there will be a new one. They're not going to help you. I think the Australian new business they need to find their own business model. And there are a lot of out there. If you are a dinosaur, that's what we call them. Dinosaur means you are an old company, still using the old business model, and you do not invest in new business model because you are afraid of change. And those companies are afraid of change. They try new things. They convince you that they have new things, but the core of the business is still the same. And the problem with that is when something goes wrong, they go back to the core business. And because of that, they're postponing every time the problem and on the long run it's gonna hurt them really hard okay let's continue um if register a news business corporation which has indicated intention to bargain a responsible digital platform and register news business corporation must negotiate in good faith okay if there is an intention to bargain dp needs to negotiate that's what they're saying here right i understand that then we have if i mean 
if there is no uh, uh, agreement between the parties within three months of the registered news, corporation indicates an intention to bargain. Okay, then you have arbitration. So if you are one Australian news business, if you don't like what they offer, just say nothing for three months and then you go to arbitration. So you're putting a lot of pressure on the digital platforms. I can understand that. So you're putting a lot of pressure. And here the lot maker is thinking three months is enough. Why is three months enough? Why not six months? On the other side, you can say three months is too long. Why not one month? Mm. I think I understand why they choose three months. But if I'm the digital platform, I'll be like three months too short. Because I need to negotiate with a lot of people. And then you can say put it for six months. But okay, let's see what happens if you do not meet the requirements. So this is when you are going to, uh, when you have arbitration. And arbitration will select between the final two offers made by the parties. Yeah, so they submit a final offer to the arbitration panel and the arbitration panel choose one of those offers. Okay. Okay, this is interesting. The arbitration panel must accept one of those offers unless... So this is a reason to say no. It's a reason to say no. It is considered that the final offers are not in the public interest. But what is public interest? In which case... So they can change the offer to a more reasonable of the two offer, or they can create a new. Okay, it happened in limited circumstances. Okay. Okay, okay, I, I can understand this. I, uh, I understand this, so what they're saying here is that we have arbitration if the application cannot choose one of those two final offer, they can create an own offer and it has to be in the public interest. I can understand this. The question is, will this work? Because you're limiting the power, you're giving the power, the small parties a lot of things that they can do. You can just wait until the there's an arbitration and during the arbitration they can, um, they can let um, let someone else choose for that. Hmm. It's a tricky one because I uh, I don't know what to say about this because you can go a lot of ways with these things. But um, okay, so um, let's look at this so you guys can see what this part is before we go start uh, with the next one. I think next time we'll do it next time. So you have here things that they have in the new law they will show it here and in the current law they don't have it they show what is new and this will give you a summarize here so you know what it is yeah so technically almost everything in here is new it's something you need to keep in mind i have a dream that's all i need i'll make it happen with some work and belief know what i want so I'll take it on I've made mistakes, but mistakes make you strong Let's break it down for a minute I want the crown, I'm gon' get it You hear me loud, man, I'm winning Yeah, Charlie Sheen will be